everybody. So, one, well, first, happy St. Patty's Day. And second, something amazing happened to me today that I completely fangirled out. So I'm just going to take a little second to, you know, share it with you all. I um, posted a photo on Instagram uh, Tuesday. And I had tagged Spencer's, the store, um, and tagged them in this little heart because I got it there. And today, this morning, they freaking liked it. They liked the photo, like, the store that I follow on Instagram. They liked my photo, and I freaked out, and it made my day completely. So, that was a plus. Um, but, anyways, I'm very sorry for not making a video and uploading it yesterday. I had, like, a me day. Um, I didn't do anything. I just kind of took the day, relaxed, and... It was well needed, um, but so I'll, I'll be making two tonight and uploading them, so I like to make up for yesterday. Um, tonight's first one will be a little longer because I'll be doing my eyeshadows, um, and then the rest will be kind of short, um, but let's just go right into it. So this one is about all of my eyeshadows that I own. Um, what I found I liked better, which ones I like better, um, the quality of them, you know. Um, so, I'll start with my most used and liked. Um, I have three different palettes from Hard Candy. Um, this one is 887, and these ones are all natural kind of looking ones. Um, if you can see those colors, they're very, very... Use. You can tell which ones I don't use that often, but which ones I do. Um, and I have all of my purples. And this one is 525. Again, you can see which ones I use the most. I love the purples and the grays. Um, the black is very, very defined in this one. And apparently my white just fell out. Um, it's very dark. And I like it for the under, like under my bottom waterline. And if I'm doing, like with my Halloween look, I did it for the veins. It's good when you need a dark look. Um, and this one is the blues that I own. And this one is 527. And yeah, the blues in this are great. And this one, I guess, is kind of coming off purple from what I can see, but it's not. Um, it's like a navy blue. It kind of has a tinge of purple in it, but it's more blue than anything. And they are all from Hard Candy. And I, I use those palettes almost every day. When I use eyeshadow, sometimes I won't. Sometimes I'll just do either mascara, eyeliner, um, a wing look. It's kind of all depends, but most of the time I'll try to incorporate um, eyeshadow into my look. Um, this one, what I'm wearing today, is a cream eyeshadow, and it's from Hard Candy as well. Um, I love it. It's very glittery and sparkly and, um, awesome. It's really easy to apply. It's just a, uh, it's just a sponge, and it's, it dries within, like, 30 seconds, like, um, most cream stuff, but the code is 948, and it's Eyelac. It's actually one of my favorite eyeshadows to use right now. And then I have just this basic white from CoverGirl. Um, I'll use it in, like, the corners of my eyes, um, or, like, right in here, or if I'm doing like a full lid of white, it's great, it's very pigmented. Um, and then I got this, this Avon palette from, well, for Christmas. Um, I love it. It has all of the eyeshadows right in here, and then these up here are uh, blushes and then bronzers and then lip gloss. 
Um, this one, the eyeshadows in this one are very, um, it's a very, um, diverse set of eyeshadows. Um, there's, like, natural earth tones, then there are, like, the blues and the greens and the purples and the grays and blacks and browns. Um, one of my favorite palettes to use, um, I haven't had any problems with Avon. Um, I don't use it often. I'm not a fan of their eye, like their mascara. Um, but they're, they have quite a few, um, variety choices of lipsticks, which I like. But the eyeshadows have seemed to be, of like, I like them. <laughs> I don't know how to word it, what I'm trying to say. But, um, they're kind of different though. I found, um, like, they're kind of darker than they actually look, or some, one, a few of them are lighter than they look, so just have to be careful with that. Um, then I have this one from Rimmel, London. Um, these ones are just very neutral colors. It's okay, I don't use it often, but... You know, it's great to have if, like, I don't actually want to wear eyeshadow, like, a full lid of it, but I want to cover up, like, the, um, if I got mascara on my lid, um, it'll cover it up without actually looking like I have eyeshadow on, which is great. And then I have these two palettes from Revlon, and these ones are just brown, and it had gold, and I love the gold in it. I used it, like, all up. You can see I used that one completely. Um, and then the brown. The brown was a really nice brown. It was like a chocolate brown. And it could be darker if you put a couple layers on. But if you didn't want it to be too dark. But give you that... Um, well, the wearing brown look. Um, it was great. And then I have the purple and the pinks from Rimmel. Um, these are great. I love the purple in it and the pink. They're actually, um, <clears throat> they're very pigmented and they actually show the color that is there because, like, most eyeshadows I find, found, um, they'll either be really darker than they actually look or they'll be really lighter, but that one, the two colors in them have actually <clears throat> been what they show so anyways um oh and i have this which is all right um it's from covergirl and it's just um it's like the purple it's like the cream shadow and it's like a silver um it's okay i haven't used it in a while um it's very good if you want it like a glittery um and if you put a couple layers on, it's a good base. Um, it kind of stays a little tacky, I found, throughout the entire day. Like, it doesn't full-on dry. Like, this one or any other cream ones that I found. And it gets, it's kind of clumpy when you put it on. So, like, it'll be really dark in one spot where you apply it. And then, if you try to smooth it out and blend it, it doesn't really blend properly. So, it's not my favorite that I have but it isn't the worst I've had um but yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up comment subscribe um follow me on my social media sites which I will link in the bio and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed it again I said that but if you have any requests of videos you want to see, definitely leave your requests below and I will read them and try and get to do the videos. Bye guys!